Welcome to the jungle. Well, our world has turned into a jungle. So insecure and unpredictable. First with trends like globalization and digital transformation. And then we've all become hostages of a pandemic that limits our freedom. And we cannot escape the climate change either. We don't even know how all this is going to evolve or when it's going to end, if at all. And this insecurity is a great challenge for many people and companies today. And this insecurity was also a great challenge for me in the year 2000, when being taken hostage by a terror group named Abu Sayyaf for 140 days into the Philippine jungle. From this experience, I learned how to keep your head in such a situation and how to stay strong and even grow stronger from such an experience. Therefore, I'd like to invite you onto a journey into my past and kidnap you into the Philippine jungle. I'm going to share with you my jungle strategies that helped me to survive in the hands of heavily armed terrorists and translate these jungle strategies into your, into our world today, full of change and challenges in our private lives and the business world. Because these two worlds are actually quite similar not only regarding the challenges ahead, but also regarding the way that we can tackle those challenges. And this is what this journey is all about. You will join me on a dream vacation, a diving trip to the lovely island of Sipadan in Malaysia. And then we all become abducted by heavily armed terrorists. And you will become part of a hostage group in the middle of the jungle and in a guerrilla war you will experience how to strengthen your inner resilience and become part of an agile team that flexibly handles the insecurity of the jungle. In the end, I promise you, you will also be set free again in the end of this journey as I was in the year 2000. And we all together return home safely. During this journey, you will, for example, learn how to use acceptance to deal with the challenges ahead instead of struggling with them, how to stay optimistic in times of despair and why too positive thinking on the other side can be dangerous and what to do about it. I look forward to meeting you during one of my talks or virtual keynotes. Meanwhile, all the best and stay strong. Thank you.